No war. war. No more war. No more war. I'm not done yet, though. So, um, but, but, but no, no, it's the same. you say that now, but at the time, I said it then too. But it, I'm saying that there was this whole mythology that it was all about Bush. Uh -huh. It was all about corporations. Right, but do you feel like all that stuff about it being about Bush contributed to the idea that people thought it really was about Bush? But it's not about just one person. But, but people did think of that at one time, right? They, they would create cool. statues and posters and... What's that? They were fooled. They were yeah. fooled. Yeah. He's saying. And we have a sign that we carry at the demonstration. It's good for any demonstration. It says, American imperialism is humanity's number one enemy. Yes. But you say they were fooled. Were you fooled? No, I wasn't. Did you ever have Bush signs? Yes, but I didn't have Bush signs. Bush is a war criminal. I know, but anti I'm saying, Bush signs. I'm saying Bush they, they were anti-Bush signs. They weren't anti-imperial signs. Bush could be replaced with any. That's her yeah. sign. It wasn't mine. What kind of signs were they? Yeah. They were. They were signs that said our corporations are running the country today, and they're white and they're concerned with making money, and that's a big concern. And they're not concerned lives that are being lost and the services that our people are losing. So they're uh, pretty much making money off of the war. Yes? Of course they make money off of the war. That's why we're at war. It's endless war. And, uh, you know, Eisenhower said that. Beware of the military industrial complex. Beware of it. Yes. And we were both alive when Eisenhower said that. We remember it well, do we not? Yes, we do. Yeah. Thank you so much. And you're out here on the Golden Gate Bridge today. Um, and why are you here? Just because I'm trying to rouse voices to help us end the terrible wars and the terrible killing that is going on. That, especially that for which we are responsible, which are the wars in Iraq and Afghanistan. So you think by being out here? Someone will pay attention and someone will end these wars? That's always the hope, isn't it? It's always the hope. Yes. And where are you from? Berkeley. Berkeley. And did you come over here uh, as part of a group? Came over with a group called Grandmothers Against the War. And can I ask your name? Ruth McGuire. Thank you, Ruth, so much. Thank you. That's great. Very eloquent. Very eloquent. Slowed you down from your. You want to walk with me and we can get up there? I'm probably slower than you. <laughs> I have this disability. Oh my god, are we on our way to Marin? Yes. Have we passed the halfway mark? Oh my god, I wasn't going to go. I was going to go this <laughs> I wasn't going to walk all the way over here, but now I'm committed. <laughs> oh my god. I'm not sure I have enough. I'm, I'm videoing this. 